Hi guys, so this is the bedroom tour. Most of you requested uh, I show you guys my house tour. So this is a bedroom tour where we start with uh, this is my traveling bag. You guys know I love uh, traveling a lot. Yep, then the bed. So this bed has been there for ages. Ages like we're talking about years. Eh? Um, maybe 20, 20 years so yeah that's my bed I'm changing the net because I just bought another net a uh, mosquito net and purposely I'm targeting you know the way you uh, you put like a, like a triangle we have rails we have rails in the ceiling so I'm targeting that so at least I can fix uh, the net uh, to be the sliding net uh, in the next video I'll show you guys that so in my bedroom also I have my office space so what's in my office space uh, first is my internet okay so I have like uh, internet connected to the computer because I don't like using Wi-Fi on the computer I like using LAN and this is an, an advice by uh, some techs that uh, it this is my office this is where I edit my video from this is where I export my videos from so sometimes you might have some you guys know I have a contract with Safaricom for the videos so some, sometimes they ask me for ba ba batch uh, videos like they want like 20 or 30 videos from me so I have to edit prompt and the export speed has to be faster so at least i can deliver the job uh on time and very fast so yeah so that, that's why i connect my internet i have two internets one in the sitting room and one in the bedroom near my office so that it's connected to the computer via lan yeah so yeah this is my lamp study lamp mm, it's a tablet uh what else a printer i have a printer in case i have some some things i want to print and basically that's my office space yeah so in the same same bedroom it's it's a suit so this is my toilet and my shower area yeah so within the bedroom so basically that's it for my bedroom space oh we have the drawers here not the drawer mm, closet we have the closet on that side so basically that's how my bedroom is as simple as that uh, let me know what you think about it let me know if i have to rearrange oh let me talk about the bed uh, initially the head of the bed was facing the other side and then after doing a research and realize that actually you're not supposed your head is not supposed to be facing north i've done a video on that if you haven't like it's the video i think before this so go check out why you should never like have your head facing north so that's why i moved the head from that side because uh, north is around here north is around this direction i have a compass and so this should be east that should be east and now i would like uh, my bed my head to be facing somewhere in between south and and east or southeast so that's why i had to to change my bed around check around guys and let me know what you think because uh, some of you have different views and yeah let me know what what uh, how, which side your bed is which side you lie your head facing so from my bedroom uh you come to now the corridor and on the corridor i have put this big mirror i've had it for a very long time so i love mirrors so it creates like an ambience of space uh of course psych psychologically and if you've done art and design let me know if that works also for you uh having mirrors in the house big mirrors create like more space mentally so this is my daughter's uh, bedroom 
my daughter come visit us and yeah so that's where they have their charging ports I've, I decided to put some two charging ports on the side and it's a massive bed of uh, actually it can be shared between two or three people no more than that because uh, it's eight by six eight by six purposely because sometimes we have visitors so on the same same corridor this is where I put my books you guys know I love reading so these are the books I have most of them have been borrowed by friends uh, friends who decided that uh, they are not going to return anytime soon yeah so those are my books let me know if you've read uh, some of them and this is a game we call it monopoly that is game of uh, this is Kenyan monopoly it's called kumiliki I'll show you in a different video so in a nutshell that's my book uh, shelf yeah next to the bookshelf is where I have my shurak so that's my shurak uh, let me know if I need to change because uh, uh, I think it's getting smaller by day yeah or maybe I need to change like uh, I need to reduce the number of shoes I have so that's my shoe rack over there so next on the same same uh, corridor we have this is my son's room so this is my son's room come boys room so that's why it's a double decker it's a double decker I put those uh, the square net so in case we have like uh, excess visitors you guys know i love hosting so when i'm hosting uh, people that's where they normally spend yeah and that's uh, his uh, closet and now over here this is where now he does like his study from or anything that he wants to watch from his room so that's where uh, he's in school actually you guys know my kids are in boarding school eh? so he's in form one so basically that's his room so next on the same same corridor we have uh, the visitors toilet and we have the visitors uh, bathroom then right next to it we have uh, now the sink which has a mirror as well and that's where they put their toothpaste and toothbrushes yeah so that's the corridor so next we'll go to the sitting room and from the sitting room i'll take you to the i'll finish with the kitchen yeah so starting sitting room from the kitchen actually uh this is an open kitchen you guys can see this is an open kitchen that's why i'm starting uh this uh, video from the kitchen going up so of course as usual we have the two sinks uh we have the drawers up here mm -hmm. the antiques i love antiques and of course we have food uh, going on and i love this eh? i love uh this is like a warmer so it keeps food warm for a very very long time yeah, once you connect it to electricity the food remains warm for a very long time uh, now the dispenser is right over there what a dispenser but now someone was telling me uh, the puppy house should be far from it I don't know whether to make it to keep it here or to choose another location but I thought that's a very good location for for the puppy yeah so that's my sink and that's me you're one and only one i like like you guys know i love mirrors eh? so i have two mirrors i have an artwork up there uh, that's now the second wi-fi remember you saw the other wi-fi in the bedroom so this is another wi-fi and up here we have my small my small display so we have a drone this uh, drone I bought long time ago that was before uh, DJI came with a very small and very efficient uh, DJI Mavic 
which is something I also need to also need to look for. So under that, we have, so this is my own work actually, making this is my own work, my own design and the TV stand, that's my own design my own creation if i may say so now this roof as well this is my own design so uh the original roof was that one if you guys can see that that's the original roof now this roof is uh, what was made when i was before i got in here so this is this was not here and this is my creation uh we have the the snake light behind there we have uh, the usual now roof and the reason why I chose this roof was because of uh, content creation because uh, when you put on the lights it gives you more more light so more light now over here I have tiny speakers eh? I have tiny speakers which are I was meant to connect to the to the television so it's a complete set the other sets are over there but now these tall boys these tall boys were the ones that I was I was using before but now uh, the dog I used to have before decided to eat all the wires eh? so I need to reconnect the wires again and the other tall boy is right at the corner the other one is here so i have to reconnect again if i want to watch movies in a surround system yeah what else this rack very famous all of you know my house with this rack so these are movies these are movies i used to watch long time ago actually most people think it's a bookshelf it's not these are movies eh? you guys if you can remember the time you used to watch these movies crash yeah, so these are movies all of them all of them and again this is my own creation it's iron rod it's it's iron uh, this one I uh, went personally to the factory to have it pressed and that's the design I wanted because as you realize even my my mirrors that's the design they take the s design so that's also my design i had it pressed uh in the factory uh that's why you can't find it anywhere else apart from mokazi's residence yeah those seats you guys know them so i love playing sometimes draft that's why one table is a uh, draft uh, the other ones are just usual we have the big table behind there uh that uh actually we broke one of the glass and we have to replace so this it's a familiar with you then this is my storage uh more like uh this is very antique by the way very antique very old the wood is exotic and that's why i store my filming things my stand my gimbals my camera lights and the umbrellas yeah so that's where we store them and yeah so where else do we go from there so on the outside i have this one this is meant to be for wine yeah wine storage and now the drawers so wine storage and the drawers so nice amazing drawers okay over there and we have the seats the tour seats i used to travel a lot with those seats so like always i like putting my sockets everywhere so this is outside corridor i normally like putting my socket so that when you're seated uh, there you can be charging your phone so that's a corridor so i have the uh, artificial grass that i want to put here underneath yeah so coming outside what do we find here so you find that seat that i'm trying to work on very antique uh, very old that table that's usual now this one should be in but now it's drying up after after washing so this one will go in uh, on the far end okay i have rocky the puppy there so we have the two bikes that were for my daughter 
and this is now the the artificial grass that is uh, actually being washed then now we can put on the corridor then we have oh this is a jiko this is a for roasting meat this one I normally use outdoor to roast meat so uh, just know I have the jiko you come with the meat and we do the roasting yeah so these ones I planted myself the grass needs to be made short and now this this is a artificial grass I'm trying to to create so I have there are two long ones uh, so this is one you can see how big it is eh? let me span it back so you can see how it's filling almost the entire space and yet we have this one here we have this one here that is not yet actually like washed even this one is not washed but now we have this that is i feel longer than this one yeah so if you are interested let me know then we have this bed that i normally like resting on uh, when I'm at outdoors, I love resting here, reading from there. And now we have this bike for my son. Yeah. He's in school, he's in boarding school. And behind there we have our garden. So behind there I'd say to be garden for vegetables. Now these are the flowers. And that's my neighborhood. Okay. So how the neighborhood looks is uh every house has their own like uh this is it's a gated community every house has their own small compound yeah and short fences you can tell you can see so all of them are similar three bedrooms uh yeah so most people bought the houses and they decided to live in them some decided to rent them out yeah so come on the comment section let me know what i need to change what i need to replace where yeah and i'm here to listen until the next video bye bye guys